A Santa Fe woman who's traveled the world like few ever have has waited for an honor for six decades. News 13's Erin Drawhorn has her remarkable story. Helen Schreider doesn't look her age. Well, I don't feel it either. At 89, Helen is an author, accomplished artist, and adventurer. We traveled the world many times. Helen's travel companion, her husband and love, Frank. A wonderful guy, but constantly amazed me. In 1954, the Schreiders traveled the unfinished Pan American Highway from Alaska to Tierra del Fuego, two and a half years and no easy task. So they used an amphibious truck in coastal waters. It turned out that that was the beginning of our profession. That feat earned Frank membership in the exclusive Explorers Club, an honor reserved for the likes of Teddy Roosevelt. Women were not allowed to be members. It was a, definitely a an uh, all boys club kind of thing. Helen and Frank traveled the world. Each trip was just its own universe. The husband wife traveling team worked for National Geographic for 15 years, exploring at least 100 countries far off the beaten path. Did you ever feel in danger? <laughs> I'm afraid yes, the answer is definitely a big yes. From peril on the sea. We once were caught in a real bad storm. And pirates off Panama. I guess they thought we were a good target. To feet from being at death's door in Indonesia. They said, you know, they still take heads and yours would do just as well as anybody's. Their journeys documented in three books. And after all of their destinations, Helen still couldn't join the Explorers Club back then. Well, I never, ever thought it would happen. But it did. As a recent surprise, Helen was named not only a member, but a national fellow. And all I could think about is, you know, now I know why I've lived so long. <laughs> Aaron Drawhorn, KRQE News 13. Helen's husband, Frank, died on their boat in Greece in 1994. A documentary is being made about her life. To learn more, log on to krqe.com.